Will Ballantyne tallied six goals on seven shots to lead Franklin and Marshall to a 14-8 victory over McDaniel Saturday afternoon. The Diplomats improved to 8-3 with a 3-1 mark in the conference. f and never trailed and jumped out to a 6-0 lead early in the second quarter. Ballantyne got things started just 1-18 into action. And Billy Kepner finished off a pass from John Barney to make it 2-0 at 1049. Chad Gamble found Jamie McCulloch before Ballantyne scored three straight to make it 6-0 at 12.09 in the second quarter. McDaniel netted its first goal at 11.25 in the second, and the Diplomats countered with goals by Tommy Wank and Chad Gamble to make it 8-1. The Green Terror hung around and put two through in the final 3.15 of the second quarter to make it 8-3 at the break. Kempner found McCulloch early in the third for a 9-3 F&M lead, and Timothy McNoll's goal for McDaniel made it 9-4 with 6.26 left in the third. Michael Bossidy picked up a pair of goals in the final five minutes of the third, with Kepner assisting on the first and Evan Bax on the second to put F&M up 11-5 at the end of the third. Ballantyne continued his dominance when he buried a pass from Chad Gamble early in the fourth, before McDaniel netted two straight to come within five at 9.27. FNM answered with two of their own to make it 14-7 at 5.30. Philip Gamble picked up the first goal, and Ballantyne netted the second off a pass from Bass. Carlos Pelez paced the defense with two calls turnovers and a team-high six ground balls. Josh Cantor had two calls turnovers and four ground balls. And Connor Melillo finished with three ground balls and two calls turnovers for the Diplomats. Cameron Setti had improved to 8-3 with six saves. The Diplomats return to action on Wednesday when FNM travels to Scranton for a 7 p.m. matchup.